and welcome to Marsha's Mush and Stuff. If you're new here today, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button, ring the bell so that you'll be notified each and every time I upload a new video. Also give a thumbs up because it definitely helps the channel continue to grow. And with all that being said, today I am participating in an open challenge hosted by Broke Girl Aesthetic and OK at Home DIY both my friends Tiffany and also Zaina. So make sure that you check out my description box where you'll find DIYs, crafts, hauls, so much inspiration and new things. And the only rule of this challenge is called Fun Time Friday for a reason because the only rule is to have fun. <clears throat> and with that being said, let's dive in and let's have some fun today, Friday, Friday the 6th. So let's start out with the signs at the Dollar Tree right now, you guys. Oh my goodness, the signs are ever so pretty. You can craft with these, you can DIY with them, or you can use them as is and pop them into a wreath. And that is, I plan on doing a mixture of both, using them around the house and also popping them into wreaths and also crafting with them. So that's why I got so many. So this would be considered part two of the big haul that I recently did. And if you missed that, I'll link it below as well. But they have this two-piece decor set in Crafter Square. And it does say, Beware Black Cat Crossing. And then the other one says, Trick or Treat with the pumpkin on it. And that's what those look like. Super cute. Super, super cute. And you could consider this 50 cents each you guys i forgot to put my glasses on my eyes so let me do that real quickly so i can see you a bit better so this one says the same thing but they also have this one now this one is not ribbon like this one is so this one has ribbon at the top let me see if i can hold it back up there that one has ribbon where this one has wire so really, really like that. It was a bit overwhelming because they had so much, but this one says the witch is in and welcome to our haunted home. I love this one. This one is my favorite out of Fun Time Friday. I definitely love this one the most. And again, that's what they look like. And they're in the seasonal section with the Halloween decor, you guys. Dollar Tree is just killing it with their home decor and their seasonal items. They also had this, and it's a spider web, a wooden plaque. That's that's all it is. It's just a little spider web or a Charlotte's web, if you will. But we're going to use this in the What Would You Make Challenge, which is an open invite every month that is hosted by OK at Home DIY and myself as the co-host. So we're gonna save this and we'll see what I do with it in an upcoming DIY. So I'm gonna set that one to the side so I don't lose it. I know I shared this one with you before, the Farm Fresh, because the leaf was dangling. But I, and that one is too. But I also picked up this one that says, Count Your Blessings, and it has the pumpkin in the middle. How super pretty is that one? And it's galvanized and that's what it looks like on the back. So you could do something totally different back here. You could pop this out. You definitely don't have to leave that in if you wanted it to be hollow or you even want it to change the color. So the sky is the limit, you guys. The sky is the limit and your imagination is the only thing standing in between that. <laughs> So, and sometimes I get hung up on that part. But I know I shared the Happy Harvest with the truck. And again, I think this is a repeat. But I found a different mason jar. And again, love that it's burlap at the top. Here's the other one I found. This one says, Always Be Thankful. And I love this one. I love, just like Marina from Confessions of a Dollar Tree Addict says, when it has a wreath around it, that just is everything and again it's a mason jar with the burlap on top so how stinking cute is this one absolutely love it too 
Again, this is my favorite on the mason jars. Even though I do love the red truck, my favorite color is green. So, yeah. So, I love the green truck a bit better than the red truck. I also picked up two of these, and they say thankful and blessed, and they have the sunflower on them. And how pretty are these two? Thankful and blessed, and again, with the sunflower. Super, super pretty, you guys. So, there's that one. And let's just keep trucking on. Um, this one is the homemade hot apple cider served here. Mold with cinnamon sticks and cloves. And I could have said that wrong. And if I did, correct me in the comments below. But that is what it looks like. And I absolutely love this one too. So there's that one. And again, you have a total blank canvas to DIY with after you use it. So keep that in mind as well. Also, I think I grabbed every long sign they had to do DIYs with. So I got a few of these that say fall and they're pretty long, but they're stackable pumpkins. So each pumpkin has a letter on it. So that's what it looks like. So let me go kind of slow. So there's the F, the A, love that color. And love the combination how they included all of them in this one. I think it's absolutely stunning. So like I said, I grabbed a few of those. They were going so fast, you guys. Also over here, I have a welcome sign that has some leaves. And I like this because it doesn't say Happy Thanksgiving or you know, thankful, or it just says welcome. So you could leave this up throughout the fall into December. So it does have your pumpkins on the bottom. And the only thing that is glitter on this, not even the leaves are glitter. Those are actual little wood pieces. The only glitter part are the letters. Yes, just the letters. So great job, Dollar Tree. And there it is again. And again, I have it sitting behind me. And I'm going to stand this one up right here so you can get a look at it too. And then, oh my goodness, I love this one. Every year, I fall for pumpkins, bonfires, s'mores, autumn leaves, apples, and you. And absolutely agree with that. And you. And you guys. Because without you guys, I would not have a channel. And I definitely appreciate each and every one of you. And to all, again, all the hard workers at the Dollar Tree. Definitely appreciate you guys as well for working so hard. And then we do have the Hello Autumn. I shared this one before, but it was in with my stack of long signs. Because I like to take these and flip them over and do my own take on them later on and use them in crafts and you can put them together and make it an even bigger sign and you could use a little bit of the spackling to go in between and there instantly you have a big board super cool so another one of those and a few more of these and then we have this one that says happy fall <clears throat> And I love the bird detail on this one. It has a few strings hanging off of it. But again, these are, this one's not. This is paper, but this is like a little raised up 2D part. But it just says happy fall. And I love the sunflowers that they've incorporated in it. So how pretty is this one, you guys? Again, I think all of these are my favorites because they are brand new and I did not see any of these prior. So I am loving the seasonal decor at the Dollar Tree right now. This one is the welcome one that we looked at before. So there is it. And I think they're all the same after that. They are so great. So we are finished with those. And I usually take my hauls out of the bag 
But today, friends, I didn't because there was just too much to share and I wanted to try to keep everything together as much as I could. So I also wanted to share these little beauties with you. So I do apologize for the rustling of the bags, but check these out. Oh my goodness, you guys. So we have the blue and the red metal truck. This one says grateful and they are 10. So I said metal, 10, whatever. And then this one says thankful. So we have grateful and thankful and how absolutely beautiful are these. They just had a few left, so I grabbed the ones that I could. They are that pretty, and that one is by far my absolute favorite of the trucks. I love the color that they used on it and the color of the pumpkins in the back. Everything about this one says perfection. For a dollar, a dollar, you guys. Oh, you know you can't beat that. You cannot beat a dollar. At Hobby Lobby, this would be at least $10. And that's probably after your discount. Even though, again, I love you Hobby Lobby and I love shopping there, but the decor, I just can't beat it for a buck. And if I can save a dime, I'm definitely going to. So also we have some more signs. These two are the same, again, <clears throat> so I'll just kind of put those to the side, kind of running out of room over here, but this one says, <clears throat> family where life begins and love never ends, and how beautiful is that one, absolutely love the same, and again, I was just grabbing signs, so I really wish I had picked up three of these, one for each of my daughters and one for myself, but there's what it looks like. Again, absolute perfection Dollar Tree. Could not have done a better job on this one. It is gorgeous, and oh my goodness, what it says on it is everything. So there are those ones. Also grab this one that says thankful, grateful, and blessed. I don't know if I've shared this one before. I don't think so. I think all these signs are new. So that's what that one looks like. It's a little standard compared to the other one, but the simplicity in it is everything, you guys. And let me know what's on your wish list. And also, um, I'll be sharing my winnings from a giveaway that I won, which I'm super excited about. Also, I had a subscriber, two subscribers, win a um, subscriber appreciation that I did, and I'm super excited about that and to share that with you as well. So that'll be upcoming. I may even include a picture at the end of this video. So how fun is that? And I thank you to each and every person who entered, who watches, who listens, and who comments, all of that means so very much to me. So let's keep moving on because I know I have so much more to share with you. I have a pumpkin around here somewhere and I'm not quite sure where it's at right now. It's kind of making me nervous that I don't know where it's at at the moment, but I'm sure I will find it. I hope it's not behind me. Doesn't feel to be, okay. So moving kind of, uh, well, no, here is an R, pumpkin. This is my last name, initial. R is not my last name, but it is my initial. So it is the orange wood pumpkin that's raised on this side, so you can see it there. And then it's flat on the back, so you could definitely do your own spin on it on the back side. So super cute. Love this one too. And they also had these in white and black. It was just a little harder to find your initial. Then they had these Hocus Pocus stickers. What? After the movie, you guys, for a dollar. So check these out, Hocus Pocus. They have Happy Halloween, Scoopy, or Spooky Fright. They have the little eyeball there. 
So you can see all of those and you do get 23 of them. That is a great deal at only a dollar, you guys. Cannot beat that. Then they had these cute little six-piece Halloween DIY pins. And it's with the little witch getting stuck in the cauldron. And again, they had the little clips on the back. So you can just clip them straight on to your DIY. And how stinking cute are these little guys? Love those. And I love that they had the little... Oh my goodness, I forget, clothespin on the back of it. Also, who could say no to these eight-piece mini hay bales? Look at that. Look how cute these are. So stinking cute, you guys. So, 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 so cute. And I know they always do the one large size one, which I have in the back of my truck, but these are perfect for a tear tray or even smaller DIYs that you may have and want to include these. So definitely be on the lookout for these guys and they're hanging. And then also I have a whole bag of ribbons. So, oh, here's that pumpkin. It, the one I chose says thankful. And again, it has the wreath around it and a little sunflower detail there. These are a hot item at the Dollar Tree, so if you see it, don't sleep on it, and you like it, grab the three, because I think there's three. Correct me in the comments if I'm wrong, but I just chose one because I am accumulating a lot of pumpkins every year. It looks like a pumpkin patch, so until I get my tear tray and everything decorated for fall, I need to back off on the pumpkins. <laughs> And then not a lot of makeup to be found this week at the Dollar Tree. I think their main focus is fall. So I did just get the Maybelline Molten Bronze and that is the color of it. So not really sure what this one looks like. So let's open it up and let's swatch it and see together. I should have done this prior, but I didn't know we were gonna swatch it. So. And of course, I have no fingernails on today to help out, so there we go. So, very fancy packaging. I love the sleek look of it. Yep, and it does just say lipstick. I wanted to make sure I got the name right, but yep, that's correct. Okay, and oh, then we've got a piece of tape here too. That might be my downfall. Oh, there we go. Oh, look at that color, you guys. Look at that. That is gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I already have lipstick on, but that is what it looks like. If you have not seen this on, oh my goodness, you guys. That is a stunning color. I'm super surprised that it took me this long to pick one up. I think I'll save this one for my daughter. I think it will go with her skin very, very well. So I'm going to put this one to the side to share with her. And then we're going to run through the ribbon. So I did pick up two of the little truck ribbons. So here are those. Ran across these. Was so happy to have found these, you guys. And then let's see, also I got, I'm pretty sure I got two of each one. I got three of the truck. I got two of these polka dot ones. This would make a cute little messy bow to go in behind. I mean, you could do it with the truck, you could do it with the lemons. So I got those two, and these are all nine feet, by the way. And they do say farmhouse ribbon on them. So there you go, farmhouse ribbon. And this one is the lemons. And this one is the farmhouse, like the cow, the rooster. And it even says uh, cluck, fresh, farm. It has a little barn on it. So, so cute, you guys. This one's my favorite. <laughs> If you didn't know that already. So there are those two. And let's see. 
again. And then they had these in every color you can imagine, but I went with orange for fall and it is the gingham pattern and that's what it says, gingham ribbon, nine feet. But again, look for these because they had them in so many different colors, you guys, pink, red, probably should have picked up a red one for Christmas, but again, had Halloween and fall on their brain. So that's why I chose this one. Also grabbed the, well, there's another one of those, but grabbed the, showed you the sunflower one, but I got these three, the red and black buffalo check and the black and white buffalo check. So two stinking cute, you guys. So check in the ribbon section. These were actually in Crafter Square in that ribbon section. So these were not with the seasonal decor. These were in the craft section all to themselves. So there are those. And let's do one more bag, you guys, and we'll call it a day. We'll do a bag that has something in it rather than that. We'll do this bag. But I did also pick up this, and I did get a few of these. It says Home Sweet Home. And again, loving the sunflowers with Buffalo Check. But again, love when they do them like this because it folds up for easy peasy storage. And you can always take these apart and do your own thing. So last but not least, my friends, for today, what I'm going to share with you is I ran across these adorable, sweet little door hangers. They're the little pillows, and they say, give thanks on them. How sweet are these? And for only a dollar, these retail for $2 at the Dollar General. So right there, you bought one and you got one free. So one for the front door and one for the back door. So how cute are those? Just happened to be there, right time, right place, my friend. And also, I did get three of those and two of these because I love what these say. Grateful hearts gather here with the orange and white buffalo check. But there are those ones, you guys. And let's see, I have one more small bag that I am gonna share with you today. Needed some painter's tape, so I did pick that up. And let's see, you do get 17 and a half yards of the painter's tape for a dollar at the Dollar Tree, so not a bad idea. Great item to have in the craft stash. And still working on that crafting nut. And then also some more buffalo check ribbon. Again, this one is nine feet as well. It's the black and white buffalo check. So I had to grab it. And then we have the little owl that's green. And this one is nine feet as well with the little leaves. Love it, and I love this one with it. Again, you could do a cute little messy bow. This one was in with the fall ribbon as well. It's more like just burlap, but it has a little gold trim around the top. And again, nine feet and nine feet. This one's a little squish, but there are those. And then, you guys, I picked up this pumpkin for myself. This very rustic color happens to be the color that I'm decorating in for fall this year. So, picked up one of the velvet pumpkins. I also picked up my daughter a few. So, watch for my next haul of the air so you can see what all I did buy on my no-budget shopping spree. So, with that said, these are much better than they were last year. Look at that stem, how much detail that has. And they are rather big as well. So, make sure you check out all the seasonal items at your Dollar Tree. And that is it for today, guys. Please don't forget to go down to the description box, again, where you'll find tons of creators in today's Fun Time Friday. And thank you for letting me participate. I had a lot of fun sharing with each and every one of you. 
But thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. We're almost at 1K and sharing is caring, my friends. So share this video with friends and family so that we can go ahead and make our way to 1K and do our subscriber appreciation. And until the next time, I will see you then. Thanks for watching. And thank you to Broke Girl Aesthetic and OK At Home DIY for hosting today. Thanks and have a great day.